like. You are not gonna wanna miss this video. I just got called in to fly a thermal drone at an active fire and you're coming along with me. Okay, this is the DJI M210 drone with a thermal camera and a 30 times zoom camera. This will be perfect for the fire. Let's get going. Okay, so we're on our way right now to the fire. We got the drone all loaded up and we're gonna find some parking. But uh, so firefighters, they've been using thermal imaging cameras. They call them ticks for many years now. Usually they're handheld or aerial and uh, it's served them for search and rescue uh, finding any hot spots to direct uh, the water. So the drone, this is just a new tool in the in their arsenal, and I've been called in to help them out because I have all the equipment. We're out here right now with the DGI M210 with a thermal camera. There's an active fire going on. We're going to provide thermal and high zoom aerial surveillance. Attention all personnel, the UAV is in the air. We're going to proceed over to the fire now. Okay, using the 30 times zoom visible camera, we can see the firefighters on the southern building rooftop. They're all clear and safe. Let's go ahead and maneuver the drone over a little bit. Okay, perfect. All right, perfect. From here, we can zoom in and see there is still a piece of section of roof that's intact. And flipping over to the thermal camera, this is still a hot spot underneath that rooftop. Okay, perfect. We can clearly see through the smoke using the thermal camera. There's a couple more hot spots there and there. Job well done. Let's bring us back home and land. Welcome back to the garage. That was a pretty cool flight, wasn't it? I thought it was pretty cool to get out there with the M210 with the thermal and that zoom camera. And I, I learned a few things when I was out there too. Mainly that this um the thermal camera, it, it really saw through that smoke, and that was really interesting to me that when we were using the zoom camera, the visible, there was a lot of smoke just billowing off of the, the, the building, but then you flipped over to that thermal and it was like there was no smoke at all. So this was a, a pretty interesting find, something that I think I've, I've heard about this, but I've never seen it myself. And I think that's what firefighters, they're using these thermal cameras a lot of times in order to see through the smoke. So I guess today we got a real firsthand experience of how the thermal camera can really just cut through the smoke and and just see the, the heat signatures underneath the smoke. So I think that was pretty informative, really cool to see firsthand. Uh, but mostly it was just awesome to be able to help the real heroes out, which is the firefighters. I mean, they, they're the ones out there risking their lives. I'm flying way up in the air and standing off to the side, you know, just providing my piece of the puzzle. But it, all in all, very exciting. And I was very happy to be out there and providing some real support and I think now I'm gonna go ahead and get the M210 and pull off the SD cards, all the data, clean it up, charge the batteries, and put it away for the night. This is another video from Indiana Drones. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, as always, please like, subscribe, leave some comments below. I love making these videos, and I hope you enjoy watching them. Please give me feedback. I learned from you guys, so whatever you wanna see, I'd love to address that and make it, so please leave some comments below. All right, guys, have a good one. See you later.